in a significant turnaround. Foreign portfolio investors (FPIs) have injected a substantial one rupee four hundred and thirty three crore into Indian equities, breaking a three month selling streak. This shift is attributed to the sharp decline in U.S. bond yields, influencing global investment strategies. Renowned market expert Rakesh Bansal is backing Hindustan Unilever, Hull, and Indibles as top picks for investors looking to capitalize on potential market opportunities. Meanwhile, Sumi Pagadia is bullish on Asian paints, Dr. Reddy's Laboratories, and Grassim Industries marking them as recommended stocks to buy on Monday. Excitement is building around Tata Technologies' upcoming IPO as its shares are trading at a premium of 375 rupees in the grey market today. Investors are closely watching this development, anticipating the market response to the Tata Group company's public offering. Technical analysts are urging caution signaling a potential time to take profits in the ongoing market rally, especially concerning Nifty. The charts are being closely scrutinized for signals of a shift in market dynamics. In a noteworthy move, Ola Electric has converted into a public entity, aligning itself strategically ahead of its impending initial public offering. This transformation is expected to have a significant impact on the electric vehicle sector. On the banking front, economists at the State Bank of India SBI, reveal that the banking system may require an infusion of Rs 84,000 crore in excess capital. This necessity arises from the revised risk weights for unsecured loans introduced by the Reserve Bank of India RBI. The economists also highlight the RBI's emphasis on using liquidity and macro prudential measures to achieve growth and inflation objectives, as repo rates are deemed to have peaked. Stay tuned as we delve deeper into these market dynamics, bringing you the latest insights and expert analyses. Nugen Software Technologies Limited is set to deliberate and potentially recommend the declaration of bonus shares on November 27, 2023. Stay tuned for further details on this exciting move that could impact shareholders. The Intelligent Supply Chain Infrastructure Trust has declared a distribution of 1.0922 rupees per unit. Mark your calendars for the record date on November 24, 2023. To ensure eligibility for this distribution, Milkford Limited has revised the record date for interim dividend, now set for November 29, 2023. Shareholders, take note of this change to stay informed about the dividend distribution of 2.50 rupees per share. Ravalgaon Sugar Farm Limited introduces a new ISIN, ISIN 615A01025, for the subdivision of face value from 50 rupees to 10 rupees. The record date for this significant change is November 24, 2023. Adkin Capital Services Limited is fixing the record date for call money notice, right issue, on November 27. 2023. Investors, make sure you are aware of this date for any potential call money transactions. Thanks for watching. Please thumbs up if you like, subscribe, press the bell icon and never miss an update, share and comment your thoughts on the comment section, and stay tuned with Corporate Actions India.